The sonatas of Ludwig van Beethoven are perhaps the richest and most comprehensive body of works in a single genre written by any composer. The famous 19th century conductor and pianist Hans von Bülow called them the New Testament. Of the 32 sonatas, the sonata number 14 in C sharp minor, opus 27 number 2, stands high above at least in its overwhelming popularity. It is the so-called Moonlight Sonata, written in 1801. The name Moonlight was not given by Beethoven. It's attributed to the German critic and poet Ludwig Rellstab, who once commented that the first movement made him think of a vision of a boat on Lake Lucerne by moonlight. The name was attributed to the sonata several years after Beethoven's death. Although the piece was very popular during Beethoven's time, he was somewhat annoyed that it enjoyed a much higher status than many of his other works. The opening of the sonata immediately strikes a hypnotic atmosphere. I like to make the analogy that keys to a composer are like color to a painter. Beethoven's choice of the key of C sharp minor meant he consciously decided to walk where no one else walked before. Let me demonstrate the difference between C sharp minor and C minor. The pianist Edwin Fischer had an astonishing discovery when visiting the musical archive in Vienna. He was handed a sketch written by Beethoven of the death scene of the Commandatore for Mozart's opera Don Giovanni. <laughs> He found an amazing similarity between that powerful scene and Beethoven's opening of the Moonlight. Beethoven indicated to play the entire first movement senza sordino, without the use of the dampers. That can easily sound impossible on the modern piano. However, one should definitely find a way to observe this request. Obviously, it is further evidence that Beethoven was searching for something different, an otherworldly sound. Let us listen with fresh ears to this haunting opening movement of the Moonlight Sonata, written just months before Beethoven wrote his famous Heiligenstadt testimony, contemplating taking his own life. <laughs> 